In this video, we are going to be unboxing the all new Nelson device. The device is the best we've ever shipped out so far. It comes with 40% better battery capacity compared to the previous generation, is a better build and has longer warranty. In the box are a couple of items that come along with the device. I'm going to be going through each one shortly. Press is a free printing paper that comes along with the device, one USB Type-C cable, and a charging brick. Yep. Now let's power on the device. The power button is located on the right hand side of the device. You press and hold it down for 2 to 3 seconds and the device should power up. In setup, make sure to select your country and time zone correctly. For time zone, select Africa, Casablanca. Agree to the terms and policy. Connect to a Wi-Fi if you have one near you. Next will be to go through the other setup steps. Skip the ones that are not relevant to you. I'm the patient. The device setup will be complete in no time. Next will be to install ShopKite on the device. Go to the app store on the home screen, search for ShopKite Merchant and install. This should take between a couple of seconds to minutes depending on your internet speed. In addition to installing ShopKite app, you will install two helpful apps that will help you in future to debug or load data. First is Google Chrome. After that, you can install the Dialer app. Let's go to the App Store again, search for Dialer app. This app will allow you install data plans on your device. Next will be to move the shortcut app to your home screen, which is by dragging and dropping the shortcut on the home screen so it's easier for you to access. Then you go through your setup. If you don't have an account, sign up for one and then you sign in. Now let's add a printing paper into the device. On the top side, open the cartridge gently where the printing paper would be inserted into. There's a lever in there. Pull to the right slightly. Just bend to the right slightly and push it to the left to create more space for your printing paper to sit in. Insert the printing paper such that the paper leans on the upper part of the device like I'm showing you here and snap the cartridge area to close. Now let's charge the device. It's simple, get the USB Type-C cable out of the box. On the left hand side of the device, there's a section I'm pointing at right now where you can open up that covering to reveal the USB Type-C port. Connect your brick to power, connect the Type-C cable and check to make sure that your device is charging properly and you're good. Next, we'll insert SIM cards into the device. Of course, before you do that, power down the device, turn the back of the device and pull on that opening carefully. Don't worry, you can pull on it properly so you can access the battery compartment, remove that properly, and you see there are two sections where you can add up to two SIM cards. Gently slide the SIM card into each section Make sure that the chamfered edge is facing the forward part of the pot where you are sliding your SIM cards into. Once you have safely installed the SIM cards, put back your battery, cover the device properly and power it on. To be sure your SIM cards were installed properly, go to settings. Then go to network and internet and you will see your SIM cards network show up there. And that's it. Now let's show you how to scan products. Launch your app of course, tap on the scan product barcode. There's a flashlight option there where you be able to use that to see your barcode properly. And continue to check out. To print a receipt, you can add a printer 
and this printer you're adding is the inbuilt printer on the Nelson device. So make sure that your Bluetooth is on from your settings panel and you'll be able to set up your printer and print in no time. And that's it. Thank you for watching.